I'm like, I bet, more hot. I bet I, uh, my channel points on Ken oh. beating Light at uh, oh, it's, once it's, it's round. Let's go! All right, all right. Do the interactions, Mr. Zenas and Speed. You're, you're king wait. right here. Oh, wait, wait, what, 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 wait. <laughs> Introduce the Waseda God, bro. Oh. So we have Marcos on Rob and Rimu on Min Min. Um, Rimu's from... I mean, I, I don't know. He doesn't really want it to, like, he's, like, talk about it that much, I think. So I'll just keep it up that. But, no, uh, the matchup, it's, like, often considered Rob favored. But uh, Rimu's really good at this matchup. So I, I'd say, like, Rimu's favored to win this. Yeah, I mean, just seating wise, I'm pretty sure Rima probably was seated higher than Marcos over here, but Marcos also on a bit of a run. You know, everyone has a bit of a run to get to this top eight of Delta 7.5. And let's see who's going to be able to advance into it through Winter's side. Rima doing pretty good right now, got 100% onto Marcos now on the ledge situation. Trying to get an early uh, back onto the stage, but ooh, trying to two frame him here. Never mind. Try to grab him, but oh, trying to get that Nair, but he's barely going to be able to get the Nair straight up onto Rima here. Let yeah. Jack's Nair for him. Oh. Trying to catch him on the platform, but Marcus just jumping away. Oh, oh trying to get the road side. Yeah, nice yeah. step here. Oh, oh that's <laughs> the classic. Yeah, the classic I've been hit many times today. Oh, we're trying to get that dash that combo with landing oh. there. Of course, he doesn't get it though. Now Rima's on the ledge, but nice aggressive option here. Get him a gyro. Oh, oh. oh. okay. Just confirm. I okay, but up there does take the kill. Yeah. Evenly matched, evenly matched here. Yeah. I would say, like, both of these players, I feel like they are pretty even on uh, skill level and stuff like that. Oh, it goes to the worst. for the of his life. Oh. oh! Okay, he didn't have the, the grab empowerment right there. Good thing for Marcos. And we tried to go for the grab. Rima's really going for a lot of the grabs right here in this matchup, but Marcos being able to jump away, luckily so far. Get that megawatt there now, but oh, this could be bad for Rima here. Oh. I think he didn't. I don't know if he meant to like grab the ledge. Yeah, probably not, but oh, but this is scary off. right now. Oh, yeah. Doesn't ought to go for another edge guard, but just playing it safe. Nice, gonna be able to get a grab off now. Ruby's got the empowered arm. Okay, Marcus on the has to grab the ledge. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's definitely gonna be the roughest spot for Rob in the matchup, like here. But he's doing a fantastic job right now. Pretty low percent on the second stock here, but now he's got the gyros guarding his jump as well. Oh, oh he's taking the forward air, but we were barely gonna be able to get past it. it Did that just blank twice with the air? <laughs> Oh my god. Damn, this game here. This is that, that rub there, strong. Nice. Wait a 110% right now, racking up 40% onto Marcus right here. Gonna get hit by that gyro. Just tries to pick it up, unfortunately, failed to do, but up to luck bear. Yeah. yeah. Would, uh, <laughs> this is still done, yeah, kinda but... even. It is, yeah. I mean, Marcus, all he needs is realistically like one landing there. He is a very tech savvy rub player, so. Rima does not want to get hit by practically anything right now, but he's doing a good job of it. Oh, nice. We will catch that landing here. Planks does not matter once he just throws up the first arm here. He's got no more stuff to deal with the tank, and Rima is applying the pressure so hard right now. Oh, this could be good. Oh, oh he's got no more fuel again. This could be bad. Oh my oh, god! He, is, is he, he going dead? for the edge guard? Oh no, okay. Oh wow, he regained that pretty quick. Yeah, I, th I think Rima is like confident in his, in his like ledge trapping abilities. Like he just wants to like force this situation. Oh, oh. damn! Okay, that was a really good reaction by Rima. Yeah, that was crazy. Like, like he threw up the ball, and then saw it with the laser, uh -huh. so just decided to do the the fire input right after that. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Now Rima, one up on supposedly the worst min min matchup of all time. It's not the worst. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's meta night. <laughs> close, close. According to some people on Twitter.com, they said that it's a pretty bad matchup. <laughs> Anyways. Oh, what's going on here? He's writing something down. I, I think it's like harder at lower levels because like um the neutral kind is kind of difficult because you have to like avoid the down bees and the neutral bees. That's true. Like, yeah. I I think if you play it right, you can out camp um, Rob, but it's like very hard to do so. You Three, might as well just like go and. and go. Like, yeah, I feel like it's you can camp Rob, but it's not to the a usual mimic camping 
uh, extent. It's kind of like a Sephiroth camping. We actually have to be like relatively spaced. I feel like, because then he can still punish stuff like that uh, laser that he tried to do with the arm. But right now, oh my God, Marcos! Oh, wait, does he have a oh, jump? Oh no! Oh, nice air dodge, but still, damn, Marcos with a marvelous edge guard right here, taking the lead on the game number two on Hollow Bastion. Yeah, one of the reasons why like um, this matchup is considered Rob favorite is that like Mimic can get her game plan started, but like Rob always has that one factor that gets like that can get Mimin at like any percent, any situation. I mean, not not situation, but like, yeah. So like, even if you have a lead, you can't really be like safe against this character as <laughs> Mimin. Yeah. Oh, nice. Not at 151% oh, here. Oh, look at that scared oh. from Marcus. I'll to just get the Jarrah instead. Uh oh. Oh, oh damn. This is kind of... Oh, that's yeah. rough. Yeah. I mean, he needed to air dodge right there, but... Marcos just going all the way off stage, getting that mega lock though. Now it's two stocks to one stock. <laughs> Raymond, of course, he's gonna try and go for this back through. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's, he's gonna, gonna have to like go for like gimps or like cheeses. So I I am expecting him to like go for a, a lot of grabs to like make uh, power his arms. Yeah, I mean just Rob is definitely one of the hardest characters to cheese in the game, definitely so. It's definitely gonna be a uphill climb, but Marcos is just all over him right now on this ledge. I'm trying to find that banger, but Dreamer going in with an aggressive option, jumping over the laser now. Oh, yeah. who's the grab? Saw the grab. Oh, he reversed that gyro. I tried to get that back at him. I'm liking that from Marcos, but not really on the ledge app situation. He's, he's going for the Mega Wall smash tag. <laughs> <laughs> and going yeah. for the arms here. He kind of has to. Like, he's too far like down in percent and stock. If he could get a kill here, this would be huge. He's gonna be right back in it. Oh, that up smash! Not gonna kill just yet, but now 123%. Another arm. Marco stuck on the ledge right here. Oh my god, nice delay with the downer though. Oh, the grab. Alright. Remember pulling up his sleeves when he backed the right there. See if he can pull out the light. It will get the jump call out. It's now still one side one stock. Sure is. Oh, oh. Okay. <laughs> I mean. It's yeah. kind of hard when you got the angel play invincibility, it's just so scary. Kind of have. Is he writing down the score every single time? I have I no so. idea. Yeah, he, he, like he keeps getting up and he's like, he's like, I ban this thing. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> he's treating like this? Marcos like a foreign player. <laughs> like, <laughs> just don't like ta don't what talk in Japanese. Like? Just like, <laughs> just show him like the, the stage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Damn, he doesn't even want to talk to him, bro. He's locked in. <laughs> we'll save his words for the uh, winner interview. Three, nice. two, Each player one game of peace now, getting onto small battlefield here. Marcos was playing absolutely phenomenally into that game too, but Rebo was able to bring it back quite nicely, but not enough after that uh, second spot was gone. And oh, this is so oh, scary. I, that's death. Yeah, that's that's over. Great. Yeah, really unfortunate start, start once again for me to... Yeah, Marcus is doing such a good job with the ledge guard. I mean, edge guarding in this game right here. You kind of need to if you want to win this game yeah, right here. He, he's going for it again. Oh my god, yeah, he's just done. Yeah. <laughs> Super I, charge mega well. No, I, I think it's like smart. Like, if you know like you're down like so much, you might as well like raise up like the risk and reward. So like you have at least a chance to like bring back the game. Yeah, and he's like bringing it back pretty well right now. Already at 102 percent right here, getting another outside now at 130, calling out the landing as well at 151. And Rima's making this back after a disastrous couple seconds here. Oh, oh, okay. Wow, now it's back to even. Yeah, <laughs> delayed that a little bit too much there. Rob loved doing it, but you got the pressure like Rimu, and you've been off stage for that long. You can't afford to do that You're on the ledge here, but now Marco's getting a bit of an advantage state here, getting the air dodge. This is the grab, though. Very unfortunate. For now, playing the pressure. Okay. Maybe. Get that two frame. Oh, uh, yeah, he went for the down to combo. He's not going to be able to get it just now. I, I didn't really see Rimu going for like it the first two games. Trying to just find these stocks pretty early right now, but ooh, gonna be able to get this down tilt into the grab combo. And now oh. Rima off stage. Tries to get that reverse with the gyro. I like the idea if he like tries to grapple really fast, I'm sure he would have gotten hit, but Rima playing that pretty patient right there. Oh, oh I forgot that. <laughs> I forgot that connect. 
Remember, Mighty Game Security just threw out these lasers all willy nilly and getting him with the arm right there. Now he's up a stock here after that horrible first stock with the gimp. Yeah, if he plays smart, you can out camp like what Reem is doing right now. Like, it's it's really hard. If you just shield the down bees, like, you can, he's the Rob will just like spam it. Right now. Yeah, damn. Yeah. Tickling his shield, and Marcos does not know how to get in at the moment, but let's get this roll off. Only 72% right now. We're just doing wonders on this second stock here. He's getting so much mileage. Oh my god, he's not able to get up whatsoever. Oh, this could be scary. Nice spot dodge, oh. though. Good tech roll in. Oh my god. He's trying to scout out a panic option so much, but Remu, he's doing a really good job of just not panicking. <laughs> Oh my god. No, 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 no. Like, he, I don't think he's panicking. Yeah. Like, he, he'll, he'll do that with like a straight face. Oh, nice. Gonna be able to get that background. And Rainbow on the left hand snare. This could be ropes for Marcos. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. He had like the empowered arm, so the <laughs> F tilt killed. Yeah. Empowered arm is so scary, man. Yeah. It's so, like, it's such a difference, man. But yeah, I think without it, like even if you hit like the F tilt, like the dragon F tilt, it wouldn't have killed. Man. Especially Rob. Which one's better? Huh? Arm empowered or Sephiroth wing? <laughs> uh, Stop or like the wing mechanic is broken. Sure. I feel like I Sephiroth's is weight doesn't really said. help the wing mechanic. Yeah. It's just if it if it was like on like a heavier character, it would have been much more broken. Robo. That's true. That's true. Nice. Doing a phenomenal job right now. Trying to lock in this top five placement, but Marcos, he thinking. He thinking around. He's striking the bottle pose. What is he cooking <laughs> up at the moment? <laughs> Perhaps he's here to dash. Let's see. On this game number four on Hollow Bastion here. Getting these down to the top. Nice into the dash tag. Nice. Could be able to shield that one, but unfortunately does not get that nair right off. And back in the rough situation here for Marcos. Already at 61%. <laughs> Classic. Classic Mimit stuff right there. He's playing the ledge right here, where you can't touch him. Oh, oh, using the gyro to like get the laser out. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty sick. That was pretty Because yeah, cool. awesome. it, it can only use like the laser on hit. Oh. Situational awareness right now on Rima. He locked in. He locked in. But now Marcus got the gyro. Never mind. Just goes for the dash tag. He just really wants to find his way in right now, but Rima just making it so hard. Let's get that forward air. Be able to kill that one now. Next stack by Reimu. He tried to call out that jump, but unfortunately the fire does not reach him quite just yet. Oh, oh what? no! Oh my god. Unfortunate SD. That he even had like so the empowered arm too. Yeah, he was, he was what, at like 60%? Something like that, but Marcos at 150. Could definitely uh, even up the stock count at least, even if that was a very unfortunate SD, but... Oh, Mega one? Never mind, good DI. Marcos at 165 on the ledge here though. Stash tag. Oh my god, the terror. Oh. Oh. Caught him trying to max it down to a little bit too much on the shield here. Oh god. Oh, that was scary. Okay. <laughs> I, thought, I thought it was over. Uh, it's still... Oh. It, okay, it wasn't over. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Marcos now on an entirely healthy stock lead here. All springing through that. Very unfortunate SD for Freeman. But Marcos, he put in the hurt now. Once he's got the lead, it's looking like a whole different game. He's got that power arm now. Find his way through, though. Oh, that's that hurts. Oh, man. 64% already onto Marcos. We're trying to control the center stage. He has to play marvelously right now in order to make this one back. Maybe if he gets like a Ram Ram Nair combo. Yeah, I, I can see it. I can definitely see it. Oh, oh. back here. Just a weak hit, though. Getting back into the stage. A little bit of reversal here by Rebo. This is, could be just what he needs. The Mega Watt. Stitch building his shield right now. Finding it this one though. Trying to find his way back down. <laughs> Should have bait him. I was like, am I going to pick up the Jarrah? <laughs> Who knows? But, uh, oh, my God. Gonna fall for that Hemstar right there though. Try to charge that Jarrah a little bit too greedy. Oh, my God. Oh. Doesn't get that up smash read this time. Oh, this could be just what Rima needed. I, oh, oh, okay. This. Oh my god, yeah. Oh, game yeah, he seven. covered so much there. Okay, game five? Yeah? Wow. This, this is pretty damn close here. I mean, damn. That is such an unfortunate SD, though. That was.
He had like Absolute full dread. momentum. Then yeah, for sure. Just like Marcus crash. wasn't finding his way in, but yeah, Rima shaking his head at that one. But game five, you know, holding Slate to work with. Man, man. He's what, doing like really well, well but yeah. like he's just getting like unfortunate stuff happening. I wouldn't say cheese because that's what like Rob excels at. Like, <laughs> it, that's his, that's his, that's Rob's Three, game plan. Yeah. Two, one. We're going Go! to Battlefield for the last match for one of these players in the winner's side right here. Marcus will be able to get his stats back, trying to find the stock early right here with the downer, but playing this one patient. 47-4% onto Marcus off of that one risky uh, attempt here with the downer. Got the jump burned right now. This could be bad for Rima. Nice downer, though. Oh. Down zone into the grab. Throwing him off stage right now. So it's oh. so scary. Oh, damn. Ooh. Nice. Green has now got the center stage here. Let's see what he tries to go for. 15% on Marcos. He's trying to land. He's just controlling the center stage so well right now, but now he's got the Mega go on. Never mind. Decides to opt out. He's trying to find that fire on. Gust the Mega One again here. Get the Mega One oh, here. Right. Yeah. Damn, that's going to kill him. Rebo again with the stock lead here. Let's see if he can hold it in this game five. Barely hit. Can we pick that one up. Wait, up air? Yeah. Never mind. Really good DI, yeah, but. Really good DI. Yeah. I like the Nair. He was basically. Oh, reading that roll right there. Fully charge that one. 58% onto Marcus right now. Down oh, the way. Uh, uh, yeah, it doesn't combo. Oh, nice. Did he like DI up or something? Um, maybe. I think the percent range was a little uh, off. I see. Makes sense. Reamer right now. Hold on to the stock for dear life. 159% good air dodge though. Gonna make it back up on the stage now. I'm trying to find the roll read, but unfortunately, we went off to get into a up right there. Oh! Oh no! Oh, tech club by Marcos. Yeah, that definitely would have been it if he was able to get that grab. I mean, we're just racking up so much percent here with yeah. the, so little life left on the third stock, but he's keeping himself alive. Oh my god, that almost killed as well. Just one more hit, I'm pretty sure he's dead. Trying to make his way back then. Trying to find these nares, but Marcus is just not getting in on Reaper right now. Oh, goes oh, for the grab. The Never mind. Oh. Rob is like really heavy. <laughs> that makes sense, yeah. Maybe by the next one? Oh my god. Unless you have a nice forward air. He needs to find his tail. Oh my god! Yeah, I, I think he'll take that. Yeah, that's definitely so worth it. I mean, both of them were pretty much the same percent, but oh my oh. god, he made that real patient. He wanted to find that lab uh, zero to death yeah. combo right there. But unfortunately, not able to give it to him, and Rima does not want to get hit by any of these landing nares right now, just running for dear life. Marcus just, just won, he spelled disaster for him. Oh, that was a brave nair. He, he committed his, like, double jump with it. Oh. Oh, nice angle on the fire. With Tyro in hand now yeah. on the play. This is so scary. You really, like, the Rob really needs to approach in doing this moment. Oh, nice. Catching the dash out. Gonna be able to get this down tilt into the grab. Now, trying to find yeah, the road on. Oh, nice forward air. Yeah, similar situation, but, like, it's on Markle's side to, like, raise, like, the risk rewards. Yeah. He definitely needs at least this stock out of the way and then maybe can try and work some uh, crazy combo with the other one. But oh, reacting with the up smash. Marcus now 126 on the ledge here. He's got the Mega Watt out. One bad hit can spell the end for Marcos on the winner's side of this Delta. Catch the gyro. Oh, just clamps, but oh! Oh, okay. oh the pop off. <laughs> oh, let's go. Oh, definitely a very hard spot one. Marcos being a. Being a good spot there, smiling. But damn, that looked really rough towards the uh, yeah. end Yeah. Like, I, I, I think, like, this was supposed to happen. It just happened yeah. a little later than it, <laughs> we expected. That's true, yeah. This is definitely a matchup like, that was probably expected to be in the loop.